Well, hello! Today we're turning into a demon inspired by Sky Daddy. So I already kind of started off with um, some red on my chest, just because I didn't want to have to worry about that while I was streaming. And then I'm just taking red um, from Made You Look. Not red, Cherry. The name is Cherry. It's red body paint. And it's the same thing as on my chest. And I'm just painting literally everything. There's not a whole lot of instructions I can honestly give you. It's just paint yourself as red as as possible. If you think you are red enough, no. Make yourself more red. Find red. Redden out everything. Red in your nose. Red in your ears. Red everywhere. Red under your wigs. Red on your eyebrows. <laughs> red everywhere. <laughs> Literally, just paint yourself red. Just red on red on red on red. That's that's what you need to do here. And if you're gonna go out in this, paint every inch of you red. I was not going out in this, so I did not. So I'm just going over everything with red from Major Look. That's about it. And then we're going to take um, Vampire, also from Major Look. All the paints from Major Look are so far. Um, and we're just going to carve out some contours in places on my body. And then we're going to be blending most all of this out. So you're really not going to see it, but I was just kind of putting a base down for myself. So I kind of like had a reference of, yeah, this is where I'm putting contours. You could blend this out. I did not blend it out at this time. And then um, I'm taking a red tone, a dark red from um, the NYX Swear By It palette to just set slash blend out that entire area where I had put um, the contour just so it actually looks more seamless here. So that's what I'm doing is just blending that out, making it come to life and trying to hide it. I was running out of the red, like the red is it is beyond pant now. I, I will need another palette eventually if I want another red like that. We've had, I think I have three, three completely panned tones in that palette. So we're making some progress. Uh, then right there I just put on um, KVD Beauty um, Witches liquid liner. Not liquid liner, liquid lipstick. And then I'm just taking a lighter red also from NYX um, just to kind of blend the contour out a little bit more. Don't worry about the contour too much. It's really not that visible in the end. And then I'm just taking black and just completely smoking out my lids because we are gonna be going ham on it. Like, absolute ham. Like, ham ham to the extreme. And this is where things really get hammed. Um, so we start off by taking black ink, this shade called ink, and we're just splattering it everywhere. Don't mind if it's messy. You're gonna work with the mess. The mess, the mess helps us with the look. Uh, just be careful where you do that because if you um, get the get it everywhere it's gonna get everything like your monitors literally just everything um chat redeemed gave pixie a treat so i gave pixie a treat and then here's where we're going into the fun part which is the drips it's like black blood drips from every orifices 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 however you say the word every every little knuckle every little cranny we're just gonna be putting that in so i'm using a mixture of um nyx epic ink liner and then ink from made you look to create the drips um i couldn't get it to do the tear thing so i just went back in with um the liquid liner i was like screw it i'll just do this 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 pen's already pretty much dead from my one of my previous looks so i'm just gonna keep going with it and i wasn't going 100 how sky daddy has um theirs i was just trying to do inspired by um so it's kind of it's very similar to hers but it's it's different and then you'll see i gave myself some a black um brows and then I put some lines going up and then I, I originally was gonna give myself like a scar type thing going off of one brow but in the pictures you'll see that I ended up changing that to 666. We decided um, prison tattoo was the way to go with this and we're doing the drips everywhere. If you notice I'm leaving this because I'm either getting fixing a treat or giving her dinner. It was around that time. <laughs> So we're just doing drips everywhere. This is where I was still trying to somewhat follow Sky Daddy's look. And so I outlined and then I filled it in with ink just so that way it was kind of there. 
And then this is where things went different. We decided we were going to go with a demon sigil, but we weren't going to go with a demon sigil that, like, is, like, one that, like, is real or anything. So, like, I kind of just closed my eyes and whatever my fingers decide to make is the sigil that this demon uses. And it's, of course, going to have drips because the whole look is drips. We can just not have the drips on the sigil. And that's, we're, we're saying that they carved it into themselves, and because of the fact that they carved it into themselves, the demon became the person. Or the person became the demon. And this is the end results. <laughs> I don't know. Make up a story. Put it in chat. <laughs> put it in chat. Put it in the comments. This is in Twitch. But yeah. So we're just doing some more drips. Because we gotta have the drips. And then on top of the drips, we're taking a white liquid liner on top. And this is just to give it kind of more movement and some depth. And also to make it look like, you know, liquid, not random black smudges. So that's what's going on here. It's just we're, we're giving it the liquid some movement. So it looks kind of like I like a liquid. I'm just doing that in everything that is liquid, except for the ones that are in my nose. Those are the ones I didn't because Skybad didn't have any it on the underneath their nose. But otherwise, everywhere else has the light. The sigil, literally everything. Except for, oh, except for the tattoo. The tattoo doesn't. But the tattoo is a tattoo. It's not, like, blood dripping, so it wouldn't make sense, you know? But, yeah. So just white on everything. <laughs> But like, just like towards like the outer edge, like where a highlight would be on there. And I just put my wig down. So I was just kind of doing that. And I just adjusted my horns. There's like a little like strip of leather on it. And there's like two straps in the back that you grab and like tighten to keep them in place. And then I popped in some fangs. I was really happy about the fangs. And then I put on a pair of lashes. These are um, legendary lashes from Arienzo Cosmetics. The brand I always use, and they're down in the um, affiliate links in the description box. I'll also have Sky Daddy's um, Instagram account in the description box as well, since they were the inspo for this look. Um, but here's where I'm doing the 666. So I did the first six, and then I did the other ones. But I was kind of show you that I was going to adjust it in the photo. But I was just flipping the camera, because, yeah. Why, why give myself more work <laughs> when I don't have to? But there is the um, tattoo, and I just added a few more drips just for coming from my forehead. Just, you know, kind of blend it in a little bit more with the rest of the look. And that's the finished look. If you like it, subscribe, comment, do a likey, do the YouTube things, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye!